Oh, no. No, it's Winner's Finals. It's Winner's Finals? Yeah. We got Balance up here. You got Balance? Balance is really good. I don't know why he was seated so low, TBH. And He's Tam, not from around here. He has to this, be seated low. This is, uh, this is not the cloud we expected in Winner's Finals, but it's the one we got. It is. It's very strange. We got a, we had Cheeks is. get a upset a bit earlier by Doorman. Oh, no, he did. Stuff. Wow, I did not notice that. I was like, man, did Tam beat him? But no. No, it was, it was uh, my man... My man, Door. <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, he played Pichu versus Dormian. That, that's why. Okay. No, but he anyway, didn't. he didn't. I I, he might have started out, God. but I know he switched to Cloud. I... Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. But uh, hey, ooh, wow, good parry on the ball. We fit trainer very underrated in this game. IMO, IMO. That frame six is basically an F smash. Just yeah, with the balance, rating. more like balance. Oh, uh, that's inappropriate. <laughs> Shout out to Ball. <laughs> God, every time I commentate, it's just like, I don't want to talk about the match, I just want to make jokes, I want to make puns on people. Yeah, you just want to do bit commentary. <laughs> it's what, it's my thing, dude. It, it, is, it is your thing. All right. Oh, the forward air. Wheelchair cloud, though, not going to kill. I mean, uh, Tam can take we this. Need, we need to find a, a, a good balance of uh, bit our commentary. Good, <laughs> a good balance? A good balance. <laughs> <laughs> a bit commentary and analysis. Well, I was about to say that, uh, that that Tam could actually, you know, very easily take this uh, this first stock from balance, but I mean, balance is doing a great job spacing and, and, and completely zoning. Oh, wow, wow, there it is. Up the out of shield, that's going to take it, especially with limit. Yeah, but well, balance you know that has an up the out of shield? Oh, I did not know that, actually. Crazy stuff. I thought Cloud was the only character in the game with that WF shield. <laughs> but uh, 119 on Tam right now. Just kidding, it's zero. Wow, we Man, have a full stock. That as ledge is oppressive. Yeah, okay. that was, was kind of kind of kinky, though. Yeah, a little bit. Um, we fit underrated character. Has intangibility on his up tilt, so you can anti-air really well with it. Really? Yeah. Uh, and intangibility on the arm, specifically. Character has some great tools, especially compared to last game when he didn't. <laughs> yeah, especially since now that the ball doesn't move at the speed of like, you know, two grandmas raising a snail. But what? That, that was that was an analogy, boy. Can you leave the bits to me, please? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I'll, I'll, I'll think about no, it next uh, time. Uh, we, we have the ball moving as slow as uh, Colton's brain when he's trying to come <laughs> <laughs> here. God. But yeah, the ball actually moves in this game. And Dude, it's fast, and it bounces off everything. It's crazy. <laughs> and it will hit you. <laughs> It's like homing. It's homing almost. I feel. We got homing attack on. Uh, we fit trainer actually. Yeah, almost. Balance being one. Friends with the ledge. Yeah. He is man. Uh, a while ago, we played at Scrapyard. Everybody like was like, who's balance? You know, like you know, who's the balance guy from out of, out of town? All he get is camp ledge, and it's so good. Yeah, it's really good with we fit trainer. And Look it's at like, that ball. <laughs> that did so much shield pressure. Well, Tam is definitely going to need to take this uh, this second stock away from Balance pretty fast if he wants to yeah. make sure he has a chance in this game. Oh, oh that's my goodness! <laughs> okay. Is he dead? I don't think he has a jump. Oh, oh, he did. He totally did. Oh, that almost got the two frame on him. Yeah, good. Oh, my goodness! You just going to parry back here and F-tilt? Yeah, dude. He took every stock with F-tilt. That's still kind of good, though. Yeah, I mean, it's frame six. It hits like a truck. Oh, actually, I actually, I actually, do want to have next time you show com uh, commentary cam, put my uh, my Twitter on there because your boy just had a Supergirl Kells quote one of my tweets. I'm kind of popping off in the uh, in the Smash scene right now. I, you know what? Remember me when you make it, okay? <laughs> Remember oh, yeah. me when you make it. But all right, go to game two. Did not see what stage was picked. Uh, I'm gonna assume it's not triplets. No, just to run back to PS2. I right. can see that. I can see that. Yeah, I mean, honestly, like, it was just, a, it looks like a little bit of matchup infamiliarity oh, on Tam's sure. part. And uh, honestly, who knows the Wii Fit Trainer matchup? And the thing with the Wii Fit Trainer also is that, like, you can know the matchup and still just get camped. Oh, so absolutely. It's really tough. It's like, uh, finding a way to deal with ball, finding a way uh, to deal with Salute the Sun, and running away from deep breathing. As you can camp limit from Cloud, you should camp limit from uh, Wii Fit Trainer, because you will die. Limit. <laughs> We fit limit. We flim it. <laughs> it's it's good though. It's a it really is. That's a good analogy to, to talk about how it's similar to uh, to Cloud's limit because you really just have better tools at camping, but the limit itself isn't as good. But it's still like it's very scary. Like should I approach? He can react. You know, it's a uh, definitely something to learn how how the uh, particular Wii Fit trainer plays it as. Oh, absolutely. And uh, needs to get up all though. My goodness.
only 34% on Tam. I feel like uh, Tam's done a really good job adapting this game and uh, getting in on Balance's wall. And it's just a matter of time before uh, Balance finds his way back on stage. Looking for a space back here there. Ooh. Not gonna get it, but he's gonna get back. that forward air. Good there we stuff. go. Good angle on the forward air and that time. And killing. then he stands there menacingly. <laughs> he says, okay. Okay. I know my I have space to breathe. And I must press down B. <laughs> There it is. <laughs> All right, the limit. Good fade up here. Fifteen percent, though, you know. I mean, you're just taking for the damage, like cross slash, or you know. I mean, yeah. Up if you got to do up be at a shield, might as well do up be at a shield. <laughs> yeah, may as well do the Super Saiyan version of it, right? All right, good high recovery. Yeah, get the ledge. Cross slash. Okay, yeah, balance uh, really. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this deep breathing is really important for balance right now because I mean, he's basically almost at kill percent, especially a ledge to have tilt. Yeah, that pair. Bal balance is on my kill for kill percent. Uh, no, Tam. I mean, oh, okay. the deep breathing's over, so I mean. It oh, I see what you're saying. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's definitely a scary place to be. Uh, I mean, both of these characters, once they're powered up, uh, they definitely have options they didn't have a second ago. So. Yeah. Whenever they get charged up with their down B, I mean, that's definitely when you're gonna start looking for kills. Ooh, uh, just barely missing that uh that limit initial B. Ooh, catches the roll. Watch out for that ball off screen. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Tam is doing a good job of uh, fighting the balls right now. And you know, uh, honestly, not getting hit by any of them. Balance at, uh, in the last game in Smash 4 when he was playing this character, he kept ledge way more. And, and I don't know if that was because he had to, but uh, watching him play now is complete. That was great. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah. The just the jump over bear. and back air. Oh my goodness. All right, limit. Dreamy. Uh oh. 140. This is like back air percent at ledge. So balance really has to be careful yeah. right now. This is up yet. Shield, oh, shield bro, too. <laughs> you always sweep it up yet. Shield, dude. I would love to see that. Honestly, oh, it it pokes. Uh, oh, not a huge combo. Oh, oh the sliding up tilt. That's gonna take it. That's that was the turnaround one where you uh, where you turn around and then use the move. Still face. Ooh. Wow. Oh, he tried to read a t uh, tech in. Don't yeah, didn't quite get there. The ball is just actually the scariest thing ever because even while it's bouncing there, it's still an active hitbox, right? Absolutely. And it's just a matter of how do I get off of ledge at this point and how good do I parry for balance. balance? Balance is really good at these parries. That was a cross oh slash. My goodness. Dude, don't oh, that should have been stop parrying well. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he hasn't he just, stopped yet. What's his deal with uh, with just placing the ball right next to ledge like that? That was very strange. Because um, you can cancel and get different angles with uh, different moves that you use. Oh, okay, so it's, okay, it's okay. used as a ledge trap. That's horrifying. I'm, I'm, I'm horrified. Oh. oh, yeah. It's actually a good tech. We got the we got the spike hitbox from a... Uh, here we go. And that F tilt. It is very much... Both these players are still in this game right now. And it's 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 very scary position for... Uh, for balance for sure, but honestly, he has the tools to bring it back immediately. Absolutely, and this is winner's final, so it should be best of five. So, I mean, either balance can go up 2-0 right now, or Tam can clutch it out, and uh, it's, it's all up to a matter of like how well Tam deals with uh, balance's defensive options. Well, it seems like now that uh, uh, Tam's just kind of sitting there waiting, that's much, it seems to be working out a lot better than uh, game one where he was kind of <gasps> that was there. Not a what save. The? Oh Stun my salutation charge. That was a very interesting reversion air coming out from uh, from Tam. Yeah, that was actually gonna, pretty cool. Yeah, gonna get the kill. The, the early hit in there. Yeah, that was cool. 1-1 one, one going... Hey, they can't get back to PS2 this time, so... <laughs> yeah, we'll supposedly. You know, if you respect DSR at all. Hey, we, we respect DSR here at Source Game Lounge. Uh, some Line. people do. I, I've definitely commentated sets here where it's just like, okay, you played a best of 10, and uh, <laughs> you just played all PS2. <laughs> What's DSR now? I mean, like, it's out of all the stages to choose, like, PS2 is the one to ignore the DSR on most of the time, but, you know. Oh, absolutely. There we go. So, Town of City. Gonna, I think this is kind of a double-edged sword for both characters, mainly because Cloud has a little trouble killing sometimes, and that back air will definitely kill earlier. And balance has a you know so much room to just be camping the crap out of uh, out of Tam, but definitely you know not the not the quickest killer either. I wouldn't call it camping, honestly. It's more like zoning him out because definitely, I mean, yeah, yeah. he's he's a projectile character with uh, quirky ways to get in. Oh, that's big damage, seventy three percent. That was almost a, a, the spike box. Yeah, he was on the platform though, so it wasn't like huge danger, but it's still scary. Right. No, for sure.
Oh, looking, was he looking for ledge, uh, loss of legend change ability there, invincibility? I think he was looking for him to either do a ledge jump or a neutral get up or a get up attack or just about anything except for just hang there. But uh, Tim really is a punishing balance for just hanging on ledge at all. Honestly, I, I, I think he's just scared because like when when uh, when Dalton's hanging, oh, oh good, good tech, good. but oh, they get almost. that one. Wow. He got he got the the hard tech, but they get the easy one. No 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 one expects the uh, the double tech situation within like actually Ooh, one second. Yeah. And that back are gonna take it at 96, and that's Town and City helping out for you. But here we go. Crap. Yeah, those angles with the ball. Man, just <laughs> using it kind of like a ping pong ball, honestly. Yeah, honestly. Like, oh, you thought it was over? No, it's coming back. <laughs> oh no, blowback! <laughs> That was a reference to the Simpsons movie, actually. Like, I was never a Simpsons boy. I, I, dude, I loved the Simpsons when I was a kid. Like, the older episodes I have, like, seasons 1 through 10 on DVD, it was so good. And then now it's like, eh, the movie's great, and that's kind of it. It's like Spongebob, honestly. Yeah, it, like, it was really good early, and then it just kind of, like, fell off when they ran out of it. That was a... Okay, I did not know that Fair had that kind of hitbox. Probably a head hitbox. Literally straight up, basically. Yeah, I knew it had, like, hitboxes depending on, like where it actually hits you. But that was a good, that was a good uh, neutral beat from, uh, from Tam. Oh, oh, no, he catches the roll. Good job from Tam. Oh, all right. Okay, okay not, not quite yet, not quite yet. No, your heart Balance out. is also using uh, his ball attack thing. Uh, that's side B, right? Yes. Yeah, so he's, it looks like he's using side B to give himself a little bit of a, a float in the air, similar to how Cloud uses his side B to get like a little bit more float. Is that true? Uh, yes. Uh, side B gives a little bit more uh, recovery options. Yeah, let's go of gravity just a little bit and yeah. uh, stalls you out in the midair. Okay, that's what I was noticing. I was like, that's that's good stuff if you want to. Wow. Calling out his jump with the forward air. Gosh, Fortnite is really good. Oh yeah, I mean, it's not that good for approaching uh, on shield because it really doesn't have that kind of hitbox. No, it doesn't, but it's a, I mean, watching that move hit like that, it's just a weird thing but you yeah, expect. It is definitely a good anti-air. Yeah. Where not a good move is we fit trainer grab. It has such bad range, but I mean, Ooh. yeah, that reverse jab is actually really good for poking shields. Yeah, this character, like, all his all his moves, like, hit bo both in front and behind him. Um, he also has ball, which kind of floats near him. It, it, up, he it owns around a him. lot of space. Exactly. I mean, this character is all about space. Th that is the that is the word of the day. <laughs> Absolutely. Ooh, good spike hitbox with a fair into... We're looking for the low recovery. That's it. Yeah, doesn't quite get it in the back air, almost. Yeah, once again, covering his recovery with two different projectiles. Yeah, Almost nope. the air dodge there. No pressure coming from Tam, but uh, I think at this percent he could probably go for some stuff like that. Oh, it doesn't poke. Oh, waiting for the... Oh, wow. Almost. That was Almost. a good wait from balance, and now he's going to go back to ledge. That's a very safe spot for Weep It. Did that, able to does, that, does that limit neutral B, like, hit on ledge if they're not invincible? Uh, I don't think so. I what? could be wrong. I guess don't he's just looking me. for, like, a get-up. Yeah, and he catches the roll. Doesn't quite kill. Wheelchair cloud. Eh, there's a forward tilt, but yeah. Forward tilt's still pretty good. Ooh, up, up tilt. Up tilt. That's how the city helping you out there. This is this is a very scary... Oh, yeah. Yeah, there, that back is going to out back here. Good stuff, coming from Tam. And that was easily it able to uh, be pulled back into Balance's favor. Oh, for sure. And uh, we saw game one how it was not even close to in Tam's favor. It was just total lag and matchup knowledge, it seemed. Absolutely. And then now it's just... He's just yeah, he's got the download. Yeah. And uh, it looks like we're going to be seeing Tam in Winner's Finals if Balance doesn't do anything crazy and bring it back. We're and after this, uh, we're going to see Sleepyhead Cheeks, uh, the loser of this versus the winner right. of that, and then going on to Grand. Yeah, we're almost, we're almost there, baby. We're almost there. Hey, we're going to yeah, see the Game & Watch. Balance has been playing this character a lot recently. Yeah, it turns out Game Watch is a slightly better character than Weefit. I think uh, Weefit's underdeveloped right now, but I think so too. Game and Watch is the unga bugga you need. One, having go! bucket for the limit uh, blade beam that Tam has been liking to throw out, having a frame three up yet out of shield, having just really good yep. poke options with uh, bomb and nair. So, I mean, honestly, these characters are, are have very similar moves in, in some cases, very similar reaction options. But uh, obviously, Game Watch is lighter, more of a combo focused character, and uh, and Cloud's more of a I would say punish a little bit. Yeah, I mean he's definitely Fancy like a bait punish. and whip punish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but Game Watch definitely definitely has some crazy stuff in his uh, in his kid. Oh, absolutely.
kind of a wacky character. Oh my goodness, the footstool. All right, so keeping playing. space. If he uses limit, I'm pretty sure the bucket's gonna be ready. Go Honestly, I also just, oh. I just love watching Game and Watch too, because like, like what is this character doing next? It's, it's like watching a cartoon, man. Yeah, I mean, it's <laughs> it's just that lack of experience. That too. Good wait on the recovery, so he doesn't get spiked by the climb hazard. Ooh. Oh, doesn't get the second hitbox. Up smash, not gonna take it on Smashville. All right, the four throw. Oh, the long lingering dare. Oh yeah, the back air gonna take game and watch. Oh, got to point out a buff to a uh, game watch real quick. Uh, based on last patch, yeah, all the uh, all most characters dares that didn't go down before now go down. So that dare that he just did was seemed like one of those dares that wouldn't normally go down uh, immediately, but because of the uh, the four point buff, uh, we took away that that uh, that total glitch. And now it's you can just dare immediately to get some uh, get closer to the ledge, which is really good for a lot of characters, honestly. Oh, and that back here taking him at 90. I don't think that was good DI. Yeah, that was. Well, he does have rage, but yeah, yeah, a little bit of rage, but 90 at ledge. That between Game and Watch's uh, weight, the rage where he was, I don't know. Yeah, there we go. And finally, Franklin's gonna take it. Here we go. One stock left on balance. This is his winner stock. So, can Balance find his space? <laughs> yeah, there we go. Gonna be a jab punish. Such a good jab. Alright. <laughs> Press B to... Breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Press B to, to, to edge guard. Oh, you want a ledge trap? Breakfast. <laughs> Breakfast. <laughs> wow, that's actually what I'm calling that move from now on. <laughs> <laughs> Anywho, we got Limit on Cloud right now. This is a really scary point because uh, I oh, think Tam... that'll do it. That'll do it. Oh, yeah, there we go. 3-1 from Tam. Wow, it barely did it, but it do. <laughs> it, it barely did it, but it do. It do. It sure do. We got red light commentary up in here tonight. Yeah, we got rent to commentators. <laughs> we buy, we buy <laughs> crappy houses. We buy crappy commentators. Make sure you go to Smash Odyssey Friday. Make sure you come here to play video games. Shit's banging here. <laughs> Honestly, I discovered this place for the first time because of uh, the VR set they had. Yeah. As I was walking by, I'm like, oh, they have VR. I wonder if they have my favorite indie game, Accounting Plus. And I'm like, hey, I walked in like, hey, do you have Accounting Plus on, on VR? Like, yeah. I'm like, dude, I want to play that game. They're like, okay, five bucks. I'm like, oh my god. I ain't buying a 350 oh. Oculus. I'm playing five bucks to play our counting VR. Played it for 30 minutes. Had a great time. Completed the game. It was it was freaking great. Accounting Plus here at Source Gaming. Make sure you show up to play that.